So how we can get 39 plus applications in Zoho by just paying for one. So almost 39 applications for free. Uh, welcome to our video introduction to Zoho one package. My name is Raj and I have Rob with me from IT Solutions Solved. We are CRM consulting company based in Melbourne. We do offer services across Australia with the help of our local functional consultants. And today we're going to talk about how you can get 39 plus applications for free by paying for just one. The package name is Zoho One. Isn't it right, Rob? It's, it sounds too good to be true, right? <laughs> In so, some aspects, it is, mate. <laughs> okay. So perhaps we could start off by um, just discussing a couple of uh, important points about mm -hmm. Zoho One. So first of all, um, can you tell me what is the difference between Zoho and Zoho One? Oh, indeed, man. This question gets asked quite often. Yes. People get confused that I have a Zoho and then we find out, hold on a second, mate. Zoho is only a company. Zoho is a platform. Zoho have 40 plus applications, even more, where we everyone should start talking about Zoho CRM, Zoho Books, Zoho Subscription, the what part of Zoho they have. The individual products. You That's right. Yeah. So what you asked is, what is the difference between Zoho and Zoho One? Mm -hmm. Zoho is a platform, Zoho is a company, whereas Zoho One is a package of all these applications. It's I a bundle see. of the applications. Okay. So what do you get in the Zoho One package? Okay. So when you buy Zoho One, you get 40 plus applications by paying for one. Okay. If I give you an example, even Zoho CRM Enterprise Edition costs you more than Zoho, Zoho One subscription. So when you are paying for Zoho CRM Enterprise Edition in Zoho One, you're getting literally 39 plus applications for free. Okay, I get you. Yeah. Yes. Um, there seems to be a bit of confusion around the um, pricing model. Um, there's two ways that you can buy Zoho One, yeah. is, is what I understand. Can you just mm -hmm. explain how those two um, packages yes, work? indeed. So there are two uh, pricing for it. One is we call it all employee pricing. Another one is the flexible pricing. So okay. all employee means, as the word also says, that you got to buy the Zoho One subscription for all your employees. If you have 10 employees in your business and then you have to buy it for each one of them. So you'd have to buy 10 subscriptions. Then you, you have, have to buy people. 10 licenses. Yes. Right. Okay. Whereas the other one, flexible pricing, you can buy only for one of your employee or as a boss, just for mm -hmm. yourself. And you can use all those 40 applications. Just with the one with subscription. one license only. Okay. But if you had two people in the business that wanted to use Zoho One, you'd need two su subscriptions. Agreed. Right. But then again, there is a little bit of a fine line there. And the gray area is, what if you are one man business mm -hmm. and you do need Zoho Books in it as well? So what you can do is your accountant or your bookkeeper can still use within your license. Oh, okay. Yeah. Right. So it, then it value this explodes. Mm. Yeah. And if you need to know more, just ask in questions. In, in, in the comments, you can drop your questions and we can provide you much more detailed information. Okay, um, you, men you mentioned that um, it's almost for the price of one application. What, mm -hmm. what did you mean by that? Yes, so as I said before, like, let's compare it again. The CRM Enterprise Edition costs you around $55 per user per month. Whereas Zoho One, which includes the Zoho CRM Enterprise Edition, costs you $47 only. And then even if you paid for Zoho CRM, you can use it Zoho Books for free, Zoho Subscription for free, Zoho Work Drive for free, Zoho Click for free. I can keep going. <laughs> yeah, I won't finish. <laughs> and, and you probably will. <laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> um, but that sounds crazy. I mean, indeed, you it, get more or less 39 applications for free. And that's what I've been saying all along. Right, right from the start, there is a way you can pay for one and get 39 applications for free. So let me explain a little bit more in detail. As you can see on the screen that there are two prices as we discussed in, in the video before. This is all employee pricing 
which is $47.30 per user per month billed annually. We can change this figure to see the, what is the pricing per month per user. Again, just to remove any confusion, if you are a size of 10 team members, and if you buy this all employee pricing, you need to buy 10 licenses for 10 of your employees. You do have an option of going on flexible user pricing, which is at the moment, it is $137.50 per user per month. And again, you can buy any number of users. You're not bound to buy for all your employees. And there is a 20% difference when it comes to the monthly and annual pricing. The best thing about Zoho is that they don't lock you in any contract or anything. Even if you bought it annually and you don't end up in using for any reasons, you can ask for your refund except the month that you're going to ask from. So this price is inclusive of GST as mentioned here on the screen as well. I hope this helps in understanding what it is and how does it work. Again, the URL for this one is zoho.com slash one slash for pricing. And if you are in Australia, yes, the pricing are in Australian dollars. And if you are overseas, then it should show respective pricing in your currency. If you have any questions, feel free to ask questions in the comments and we will be happy to answer these pricings. They can change and we will be happy to supply you more relevant information when you need it. How do we sign up for the package? Ah, easy part. There is a link given in the description. You just need to click on the link. It will take you to create a free trial, free subscription. Guess what? Not even a credit card required. Okay. No obligation. And if you want, you can simply use it, even a free edition. Okay, and presumably, once you've signed up for the free edition, you can convert that into a live subscription. Agreed, and, and that's where the important bit is. When you are upgrading to the live uh, subscription, you are ensuring, because you are in Australia, you want your data to sit in Australian data centers. Mm -hmm. And this link will guide you to go to the Australian data center we're creating the free trial account. Okay, that's very important for some people. Um, Indeed. They want to make sure that their data is uh, housed in, in Australia. Yes. And, and presumably any data that you create in the trial will carry over into your live uh, subscription as well. Well said, exactly, yep. as is, yes. All right. Well, it sounds too easy. Indeed. Just click on the link, follow the directions, provides a couple of details and you will have your free trial created. So the next part is we always want and always request that please, if you like this video, you think it is useful, gives us a thumbs up. Also, if you have any questions, feel free to ask those questions in the comments. We will provide you more information as required. And don't forget to click on subscribe now. There is a bell icon as well, which ensures that you receive all the notifications when we upload a new tips and tricks and lessons learned and new updates and the features that gets released about Zoho and their peripheral applications. Sounds good. Thanks very much. Thank you, Rob. Thanks for your time today and thanks for watching. You Thank have a good day. Thank you.